Hi, I'm Yolanda Saber. I'm a research scientist at the Arthritis Research Center of Canada, and I'm an assistant professor at the University of British Columbia. Osteoarthritis is the most common form of arthritis, and it's a progressive uh, type of arthritis that leads to pain, swelling, stiffness, and uh, limited mobility in the joint. The most common joint affected is the knee. What drives people with knee osteoarthritis to seek care is uh, the pain that they have and they often uh, look for pain relief. And one of the way they do that is to use health food supplements and glucosamine is one of them. Because glucosamine is so widely used, we were interested in studying whether it's actually effective in the treatment of knee osteoarthritis. All of the patients in our study were taking glucosamine to improve their symptoms. We continued half of them on glucosamine and the other half received placebo. And then we followed them for six months to assess for uh, a flare of symptoms. If glucosamine uh, works, we expect the people on placebo to flare as they come off glucosamine compared to the group that stays on glucosamine. Uh, but that's not actually what we found. The results of the study showed that there was no difference between the two groups. What we found was actually that 45% of people in the glucosamine group flared and 42% in the placebo group. A second large U.S. study that was funded by the National Institutes of Health has since confirmed our findings. Although people continue to debate whether glucosamine works, scientific results suggest that perhaps it's not as effective as we hoped it might be. So given our findings, there's really no guarantee that glucosamine will work. Standard treatment recommendations for knee osteoarthritis include weight loss for people who are overweight, uh, physical activity, range of motion and muscle strengthening exercises. Uh, some people can uh, use bracing or benefit from orthotics or pain medications if pain is severe.